low galactic family. The light that illuminates the life is the light of God's love. This is the light that keeps their bodies, their world, their beliefs and even their experiences. They, my dear children, are inserted into the experiences of matter temporarily, but this is not his nature. Its true nature, children, could be described as an energy form that only radiates love. Within the field you observe, there are essentially love, which is what you are made in essence, and it is only that will last for eternity. The state of matter is always temporary, and is just as you see it, only the present. But, in fact, it is not. What can be understood as something eternal and essence, which is only love. How hard it is for humanity to feel this love that has always been guarded in their hearts, but closing it, through the inferiority of beliefs, of imperfection, of judgment, of doubt about this love. If you, dear children, could see as they are, from the point of view I see them, they could understand how shiny they are. They are the essence of love. But they fail to realize, simply because they are inserted in this experience, which often lead them to create an illusory reality in their minds, which they begin to understand as part of the matter, when in fact, are part of your light, your eternity. We understand that the three-dimensional game is hard, dragging them to a chaos of illusion, struggle for survival, the life of torpor, which are seen only as members of a planet to live a life marked only by birth and death. But, children, you are all the time looking at how wonderful life is, how it is transformed and reborn in a different way and has no end. They can observe how all forms of energy are transformed from a raindrop of water, which nourishes a gigantic tree, which bears fruit for you and the animals, feeding and gives shelter to birds. Everything in this nature and in life is changing therefore the fact observe life restrictively, understanding it is something that begins at birth and ends at death, is something that only part of his material view but not correspond with the truth that is in your consciousness. In this illusion, they forget who they are the image and perfection of God. But we do not say the physical image, but the light of love. That's what they are made, even look chaos and wonder where is this love? But it is there, within you, asking to be irradiated to the world and reach the hearts of the afflicted. Forget for a moment of love that is contained within you, due to the fact lead there lives with that look restrictive to matter, and therefore disconnect themselves from their hearts. Easily engage with emotions, pain, lessons and everything they observe occur in the manifestation of matter, and forget how temporary is all. This love you do not find out, we have said them. For he is inside, guarded overflowing in your heart, to be expanded to the world. It is there that will find it. So do not expect that love in your relationships, your professional life, what waiting outside. He will not be there, it will manifest understanding of themselves, in their peace and acceptance. Everything that manifests before their physical eyes. The matter is only an experience that will bring their growth and evolution. It's all part of a whole picked up lessons that you have chosen to live to evolve, and then raise in level of consciousness. Raising the level of consciousness is not restricted to the time of disembodiment, but it is a fact that is, from the moment they understand this rule of life, and begin to observe all this manifestation of matter as an experiment. The response they receive from those who do not yet feel this love is only a scream so he can leave, to receive this love that you have. This cry often comes as a tear, as an aggression, as a harshness, but behind it there is an application of the soul to simply receive love. You live in the midst of this material reality, and this inner struggle of yourself and everyone around you, eager to release this inner light. The feeling that you have all of you, my dear children, 
at a certain stage of their experiences, is that something needs to come out and be radiated out. They can no longer contain their emotions and what is inside, and want to pierce material illusion. Do you have a craving for authenticity and truth within the pores of their material garments, and they need to shine an amor? This first feeling of attraction to the light expands, it can be observed by reactions that are not apparently docile and loving. It is an energy contained long, trapped within a protective garment, like a bird that was trapped in a cage. Eager for freedom, Sometimes you can arouse feelings of dissatisfaction, anger, stress, confusion and even aggression. How many requests that come to me in the chaos, as there are both seeking to feel this love, which ultimately manifest the opposite of it. That is the nature of human experience, close to love, externally seek to exhaustion, when then find the inside the magic of life so finally let out their true imprisoned inside and then gradually begin to demonstrate the truth of light and love i would like to tell you today something so simple so simple but in your ego it's so hard to understand the love we hold within itself just god how much demand for something that god already has is sufficient how much search for something that is so close Look at the magic of this expression the love you hold within itself is enough for God. This relentless pursuit, my children, ends the moment you understand this because soother beasts, do fall asleep the craving desperate freedom. I know that God is with you as they are today. And then, this exposure to your light and your inner love happens more smoothly without the need to be expressed aggressively or bringing so much suffering. How something so simple is so liberating because it does not require anything to reach God beyond what we already hold in their hearts the very love that He gives them. And when making contact for seconds with this love, we'll have a deep sense of peace, of love without explanation, and the experience of this love will understand that this is the natural state of a soul the simple experience of this love. This feeling is liberating, because the light passing to expand out of its crystalline body, which is no longer simply form of dense matter, and yes is calm and adapted to this new energy, through the acceptance of its experience in the field and the host in his father's lap. How many of you who read these texts, for some time in his life they were filled with this love, where life becomes beautiful, the problems will and love fills. Let the flow of acceptance, total surrender to God and the certainty that they are one with him and enough for him, just as they are today. This will cause that can unite the two aspects the material and the consciousness into one, in their their hearts. This feeling, children, are you in your sweetest and purest form? It's exciting to see them as well, because that's how I met. From your loving brother. Jesus.